Hello all. Welcome to Career Growth. A number of times when asked what are you going to be the immediate answer is engineering. Loads and loads of students, parents, especially the youngsters attracted towards this field. I would like to become an engineer. And then comes the next question. So which branch in engineering? Well, not decided. For some it is. Uh, let me see. Um, I might be doing this, but I'm not sure. Or And for a very few, it's why this question? Of course, it's going to be mechanical engineering. And when the question asked why? Come on, ma'am. It is one of the oldest and the mother of all the branches. And yes, that's the topic of today, mechanical engineering. So what is mechanical engineering all about? Mechanical engineering is concerned with all types of machinery in industries and all aspects of their mechanism and functions. The design, the development, the construction, the production, the installation, the operation and as well as the maintenance. It also includes the working into the components of thermal power stations, internal combustion engines, jet engines, machine tools, air conditions, heating machines, refrigeration. These are just a few. They not only design and create new products, but also develop materials for them and ways of making them. Mechanical engineers use the application of laws and principles of physics to analyze, design, manufacture, and maintain the mechanical systems. Mechanical engineers use the core principles as well as the knowledge in the field to design and analyze motor vehicles, aircraft, heating and cooling systems, watercraft, manufacturing plants, industrial equipment, machinery, robotics, medical devices, and it can go on and on. So you see the development, design, and as well as the maintenance revolves around mechanical engineering. So how do I get into this fantastic branch of engineering? Very simple, yet it can be very, very competitive. Right after class 10th by opting for a diploma program or after class 12th with your science PCM as well as passing the relevant entrance exam and getting into the BE or the BTEC programs. These days there are a lot of integrated programs too. In the sense after class 12th you could be doing an integrated master's program itself. A lot of students after completing diploma would opt for a lateral entry right in the second year of engineering. Yes, you could be doing your ME or an MTech and as well as a PhD further on. Revolves around science wherein the basis or the core has to be on physics and mathematics. These are just the educational qualification that I mentioned. But for a mechanical engineer, certain personality traits are equally important. And what could those be? Well, definitely a scientific bent of mind is required. With that, loads of patience and perseverance. An alert mind a very sound hand in technical drawings and yes, excellent communication skills and a readiness to work in team. Whoever thought that mechanical engineering is just about machines and could be just a very monotonous work is completely wrong here. It's about problem solving, so you need to be very creative, a critical thinker and a keen observer. So that's what makes a mechanical engineer. And after doing this, where are the job opportunities? Well, they are immense. Mechanical engineers research, design, develop, manufacture and test tools, engines, machines and all other mechanical devices. So you see, the work area can be everywhere for them. Mechanical engineers find application in all fields of technology. These engineers are required in automobile, chemical, electronics, steel plants, oil exploration, refining, technical wings of armed forces, space research organization. Several government departments, including Post and Telegraph, Defense, PWD, also employ mechanical engineers. Not to forget, aeronautical, agricultural, power plants need mechanical engineers to design and maintain their machinery. Mechanical engineering graduates have several job opportunities in marine engineering too. After undergoing the basic pre-sea training programs 
or studying marine engineering or nautical sciences course, they can join as engine cadets or marine engineers or even navigating officers. So one can say, mechanical engineers are truly required for making a new world for the entire humankind. A challenging field which gives ample scope for a lot of creative stuff as well as solving the problems of a lot of machines and tools in all the sectors or across industries. I hope you have got a different insight about mechanical engineering, one of the oldest branches of engineering. So keep watching, keep subscribing and of course keep liking your very own channel Career Growth. Thank you.